Hey, what's going on? Are you looking to have your chat become avatars and be more interactive like, you know, these guys down here? Well, let me show you how it's done with stream avatars, which you can get from Steam for about 15 bucks. All right, let's get started. All right, so first things first, you're going to boot up the program once you download it from Steam. And then it's going to ask you to pick a language, which when you do that, it only has flags. So like the USA flag and all those other ones, it doesn't say English, Spanish or anything like that, which I thought was kind of weird. But um, so pick your flag, uh, which then for USA here gave me English. So we'll go with that. And then it'll ask you to pick what service you want to do. So for example, we're going to use YouTube since I stream on YouTube every Thursday. And you have Twitch, RIP Mixer, uh, DLive, Facebook Gaming even, and Trovo. So in case you stream on some of those, it also works on those. But for my example, we're gonna use YouTube. Then you're gonna have to authorize it, so log in with your uh, streaming information, your channel information, all that good stuff. And then once you have these two green check marks, you're all set up. So then typically, just for starters, you got bot commands. So just giving you a long laundry list of what this program can do. Uh, the biggest things to help chat stay interactive and all that stuff is, so there's slot machines, so exclamation slots. You can do roulette, chat can duel, so all those avatars can fight down there while you're gaming. Um, there's a battle royale mode, big old plane comes through, drops off your avatars and they fight to the death. Uh, it's defaulted to that the winner gets 500 gold, which they can then use to unlock streaming uh, costumes. So such things as like hats or anything like that, which I'll go over and show you in a bit what those look like. Um, all these things, so dance, hug, attack, fart even, those are all free. Uh, you can set the cooldowns as need be for your chat, but that's what your chat can do while you're streaming. It's kind of cool. Uh, a little chat bubble, you can have it turn off or on. Uh, it'll show, so the avatar will not only show the name of the person in chat, but also whatever they just said. So keeps it nice and lively. Uh, it's defaulted to have bits down here and the follow event, but for YouTube, we really don't have to worry about that since it's more focused um, on subscribers. Uh, but what I did, at least, I haven't tested it out yet, but for the follow, I put just the same notification as I would for a subscriber. So keep that in mind. Uh, and then these are all the mini games, so they can do boss battles, uh, basketball, like I said, battle royale, all the winnings right there. You can change that. And then you can go to the Steam Workshop here. And you can download a lot of avatars. Uh, for example, I have Pokemon as one of them. I have Blockman as the default. So I downloaded that because when you do download this program for the first time, there's nothing downloaded by default. So just keep that in mind. Uh, you can type in a bunch. They have Mario, which I have. Uh, Kirby, which you saw earlier. Um, and it's you know down here. You just keep scrolling. Dragon Ball Z, Among Us. They have quite a bit. Uh, and if you're talented too, you can actually create your own, which is kind of cool. So, uh, avatar and gear, so you can see exactly what happens when they walk. This is kind of the, the animation that's going to take place. So it turns into a little ice ball or gives a hug or anything like that. A little dance. Kind of gives you a preview of what, what it's going to look like. Uh, any sounds, so for example, basketball, battle royale. Anytime someone loses or wins, uh, you can import your own sounds for that, which is pretty neat. Uh, and then name tags, it's just gonna go over what you want their name, how I guess you want their name to look like uh, when you're streaming and when they pop in your chat. So uh, another thing to keep in mind on the YouTube side of it, at least, when someone comes in to view your stream, uh, they won't instantly pop in as an avatar. They have to at least type something in once in chat and then they'll populate in as a default avatar or whatever you have set up. So keep that in mind. Uh, import, export. So again, these are all the avatars, avatars I have. So a bunch of them. Uh, a bunch of different backgrounds you can have. 
set uh, anywhere you want, really, but typically in the on the bottom of the screen there. Uh, and then this is where you come in to adjust the cost of stuff. So like channel points or b just in general, they default it here to be called gold. Uh, so for me, Blockman, anyone that comes into my chat or my stream, I should say, uh, they'll default to Blockman until they have enough gold to obviously buy uh, a different avatar. So uh, which then you can go into currency settings. Uh, you can name it whatever you want. Again, it's defaulted to gold. Um, you can adjust how much income per, at least for here, it says two minutes. So there's that. Uh, and then if you follow or subscribe, which again for YouTube, I left it as the same because I'm not sure which one it goes off of. Uh, you'll get 100 gold. So instantly if you sub, you'll get an avatar that you can purchase. Uh, which speaking of that, we'll go into... The general settings so max avatar spawn uh, is 80 as a default you can adjust that as need be it doesn't really bog down the cpu too much at least on my end granite small streamer uh, not too many avatars on screen but i haven't noticed any lagging based off that program in task manager at least so um, you can choose who spawns in so currently i have everyone right now you can do subscribers uh follows and subs if you want to keep it to specific people visiting your stream but i have it just for everyone so anyone that uh pops in my chat says hey what's up instantly they get an avatar again to hopefully you know keep them engaged all that such um so yeah in chat youtube wise you have to at least say something whereas i believe on twitch side of it as long as they're viewing your stream they get an avatar populated uh, active chatters, that's if they're consistently chatting. Then they could populate an avatar if you want it that way. Uh, you can adjust how many seconds until they actually disappear. Uh, in case they're lurking or anything like that, they can kind of either still be there or kind of fade away into the background. Uh, you can save certain profiles, which is nice. Uh, enable auto-connect, so when you start it up, it automatically connects your avatars at the bottom so you don't have to worry about anything. Um, extension link so in Twitch you'll get this guy right here which people below your stream can kind of customize their avatar but uh, for YouTube gaming at least because I can't speak on Facebook gaming or anything like that uh, you'll get an extension link which will open up something that looks like this and then with that extension link that you can usually find in the description uh, for YouTube gaming at least or uh, the streamer can provide you with you'll go ahead and go into your stream avatar right here the extension you'll have to sign in with Google so go ahead and do that then once you're signed in it'll let you see how many how much gold you have uh, to customize your avatar and it's really nice on the streamer end because you can check a box to have everything unlocked uh, for you. So you can kind of show stuff off, uh, give goals for your, some of your viewers and all that good stuff. Um, so for me right now, I have Kirby. Again, you can choose a bunch of these. You just download them in that Steam Workshop that I showed earlier and go from there. Uh, you can check out the leaderboard, who in your group has the most gold. But you can also use that gold again for battle royales and all that such. So you can lose them and, and whatnot. Uh, so you can pick colors. So I could pick a different Kirby color if I wanted to. But me personally, OG. Uh, actions. So if you were to keep this on your screen, it'll show... Um, you can move them in certain ways. So for example, let's do fire. And now Kirby's on fire. <laughs> so just fun stuff like that. Just keep it, keep it live. Uh, so then you can outfit them in certain things. So if I wanted to, I could pick, you know, a top hat for Kirby instead of the backwards cap. Again, that costs so much gold to do so. So you got hats. You have some items here like swords and wands. Um, a bunch of these different side character things. So if I wanted, you know, Yoshi's egg next to me or anything like that, you can you can do so. So it's it's pretty nice though because anyone can be you know 
you'll know when someone pops in the chat because of how their avatar looks and how they've you know customized it specifically for your stream so yeah check it out stream avatars on steam for 15 dollars keeps chat very interactive battle royale basketball all that good such so yeah if you want your own avatar though and you've made it this far in the video hey come check me out typically on thursday i'm live at 8 30 a.m pacific time uh hit that subscribe button if you haven't and if i randomly go live hit that bell just so you know all right that's it for this video catch you later